you, Jesus. And as we were worshiping, I heard the Lord say, the word of the Lord is that there are some of you that think that there is something that is dead in your life. But even as Jesus came to the tomb of Lazarus and said, come out, come out of the grave, he came. There is nothing that is too difficult for your sister in your life that God cannot bring back alive. He is mighty to save. He is powerful. Our God rules and reigns. And regardless of how dead to you it looks, he has the power and the authority to bring it back. So continue to hope, continue to declare that he is God and that there is nothing that is too difficult for him. I had shared with my father that uh, God was starting to speak to me in the middle of the service and he kept talking to me about expectations. Expectations, expectations that... There are some in here, myself included, where our expectations have fallen short that we believe God and trusted God for business, for finances, for relationships, for family, for friends, for healing, whatever it may be. The Lord is speaking about expectations and he quickened the scripture to me, Galatians 6, chapter 9, and it says this, let us not become weary in doing good for at the proper time, I want you to catch that, for at the proper time, we will reap a harvest if we do not give up. You see, people confuse God's proper time and his anointed time. You see, David was anointed by Samuel, but there was a proper time to, for the fulfillment of that promise. He had to go through some stuff, but God was faithful as David continued pressing on in the hard situations, as he continued pressing on when no one else believed in him. God still made that promise come to pass. He was blessed richly, he was blessed financially, and he was blessed to rule as God promised him. What has God promised you? He's not given up on you. Do not give up on him. Because if you are faithful to endure at the proper time, God will raise you up. Amen. Amen.